Yo, what's good guys? It's uh, Friday, June 29th, and uh, it's been a while again. It's been two weeks since my last video. So on the new clutch, I put on uh, over 500 miles, so I'm at 550. That's my current mileage right now. Uh, it's also on the new throat bearing, so when I clutch in, the cold start, still no sound. The door open, absolutely no sound, so everything's gonna hold up nicely. Uh, on my, my last video, I was saying how there was no feeling on the clutch. Uh, basically, I started to get like the the heaviness back in the clutch pedal after about 250 miles, and then basically the feeling of the grab point uh, came back around that right on that mile is to around 250 miles, I'd say. You get the, the feeling of the, you know, the clutch feeling as how, how it should. So, uh, basically, I'm going to be doing some pulls. I'm on the MAP Stage 1 93 Active Team, which I have been since I've been breaking in my, breaking in my car to 500 miles. And so I'll do some pulls. Uh, I'll think about whether I'm going to do flat foot shifting or not. I'm not sure if I'm going to. I'll see. Maybe I'll do one, one or two. We'll see. And then uh, I guess I'll see you guys on the road. So I'm going to just kind of update, uh, do some pulls and a new clutch. And uh, this will be my first time actually doing a pull. So I'm actually kind of excited. So I'll see you guys on the road. Peace out. Okay, guys, here we go. First pull, second gear. I'm not going to do no lift assist, but I'll do a pretty good pull at least. So let's see how it feels. Second gear, full throttle. So yeah, during my uh, my breaking period, I drove my car like a grand mile, literally. I mean, I was getting passed by everybody, even like trucks and stuff. I was driving so slow because I was being so careful not to burn the clutch. And so I did, you know, just a few minor pulls, like around, I want to say, 300 miles. And then on Monday, this past Monday, I don't know what the day was that day, but there was all these like street racers out. I'm not sure what was going on, just kind of beat or what, but there's all these street racers out. And uh, I didn't have my access force, I didn't have anything to like, I fluff with shifting or anything, so I wanted to race so bad, but my clutch is still breaking in, so I couldn't, but uh, it was pretty cool, I wasn't sure what was going on. So, okay, so first gear. That feels pretty good. It's been a while since I felt the power of the car, so I definitely can appreciate it. <laughs> It's not, it doesn't feel as smooth though when you're not doing the uh, flat foot shifting because uh, you're going on and off the throttle, but oh yeah, I just kind of, kind of get used to it again and maybe it'll get better. But it did, didn't feel very smooth, but overall it was, uh, the power was definitely there. So like I said, I'm on the MAP stage 1 at 93 and I'm definitely not going to be eating E30 anymore. That's just, that's it. I mean, you know, I, I'm just totally positive that the whole reason why my clutch did get pretty worn out. I didn't think it was too worn out to the point where I had to get a new clutch, but it pretty much did put a, take a lot of life out of it. So just not gonna use it anymore. And then again, a lot of people will know the long-term use of a, using E30 on not with a proper, uh, uh, you know, the, what do you call it? The complex fuel kit and stuff. So I think long-term use, it's just not something that it's gonna be a smart thing to do. I think overall long-term use, that'll be a problem. So I think, uh, it's just for the better, so this is what I'm gonna do. Earlier today when I left my house, there's all these geese crossing the road and they had crossed. It looks like they're going back the other direction now, so these poor people are just sitting there. <laughs> Gotta wait for the geese. Alright, so let's do one flat pitch. really good. There was no, uh, no problem with her. It felt really good. Really smooth too. Like it just connected really good. Each each gear shift there was no, not even a slight grind or anything. It was really good. So it felt pretty good. Now I'm not going to do that all the time, but I'll do it every now and then I guess if I feel like it. Fortunately I got uh, solar traffic in front of me, so let me uh, cut the camera and I'll come back. The slower traffic got a turn somewhere, so I will drive a little bit and uh, maybe think over some other things to talk about. So, yeah, so I'm primarily just going to stay on the state of United Jackson team by MAP and then uh, just enjoy it and uh, yeah, do my polls. And then this upcoming July, I think it was July, I think it was July 14th, I think it's on Saturday, as long as they're at the Route 66, they're going to be, doing, I'm not going to be racing my car obviously, but they're going to be doing uh, those jet field cars, and I was thinking it would be kind of cool to go there and to film the, the cars racing and stuff. It'll be just something different to film, especially in 4K, and it'll be kind of cool. So that's one thing I thought about doing. So uh, that's uh, one thing I thought about. So I'm yeah, trying to do that and get some good films and stuff. So I'll hang it right up here. 
right up here and I'll do a floppy shift jig one more time. Get the second gear. Oh, got a red light, so let's so start with the first gear. Oh, of course, with the slower traffic, I'm not going to do anything, but I'll just keep talking. So, yeah, I brought these six. I'm definitely not going to be racing my car anymore. That's just, that's just a fact. But uh, I will uh, film the other cars racing, which can sometimes be fun. But uh, let me uh, continue this video a little later once I get around this track. But yeah, the braking process of the clutch, oh man, it was just so gruesome. Like, it just was so crappy having to drive so slow. All right, we're doing a little shifts. All right, I actually left it off. I'm so used to like, I'm not using no lift, just the, the first gear actually a lot off. I forgot. But yeah, the power feels good. Obviously, it's not E30 power, but that's okay. I'm still happy with how it feels. And I'll just really nothing bad to say. The car is fast, and uh, I'll appreciate just the stage of 913. That's pretty much it. And then all the other people who are still E30, I guess we'll find out what happens, you know, whether. There'll be a problem with the uh, fuel pump or injectors or what. Uh, I guess we'll just see, but I'm just not going to use it. Simple as that. It's not worth the trouble. And then all that, you know, trouble and things that dealership have to do, this is a big deal. I just don't want to go through that ever again. Because I know that time, if that were to happen, I would definitely be paying out of my pocket. And so, just not going to happen. So yeah, it's been pretty warm lately. I mean, of course, summer's pretty much here, so some hot days. It makes the car feel uh, a little bit slower due to heat sick. Okay, second gear. For so long, I went to do a video. It's just been like so long, and like it's just uh, something I wanted to do so bad because I missed doing it. So first gear. I'll just do regular shifting. Going to but yeah, everything feels good. So really, nothing bad to say. Enjoying the car and feeling the power. So yeah, next month, like I said, I might try to get a RAS season 6, and then uh, next uh, next month also, coming uh, July 7th, is my birthday, so I might try to do something fun. And uh, who knows, maybe record a video, we'll see. So I guess until then, uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'm sorry I didn't make a video for a while, it has been a while. And, uh, like I said, I was just breaking in this clutch, and it was such a slow process, man. It was just like, the thing is, I'm not working this summer, like, because I'm, you know, I'm a school bus driver, so I'm not working, so it feels like... Uh, when there's nothing to do, there's really nothing to do, so I'm going to probably do some construction or something with my girlfriend's brother to make some money and stuff on the side, but for the most part it was pretty slow, and I uh, just kind of not really drive my car that much, and it took a long time to get those 500 miles. So, so I will uh, anchor right here, and maybe do one last final pull, and then uh, probably close on the video. First gear. I'll do no list of how the first gear since the last one. Let's first gear. No problem. Yeah, Alright guys, thank you guys for watching. As always, thank you for the support. If you have a question or comment, feel free to leave me one. I'll see you guys around and uh, hopefully soon enough I'll make some more videos and uh, you guys keep watching. So thank you so much and uh, see you guys next time. Peace out. Enjoy your weekend and uh, see you around.